Hey guys, this is the Genzace iMars D300 dual charger, and if I'm right, this may be the only smart charger I would actually recommend you buying. Later on in the video, I'm going to explain to you about its smart features and why I don't generally recommend other smart chargers. But first, let's take a look at what you get with this charger. First, of course, you get the charger. This is a 300 watt AC, 700 watt DC charger. It has dual channel, has a nice color screen on it. And while we're looking at this screen, let's go ahead and do the peel. I know everybody likes those. Nice peel. This has your AC input, a two amp output, and a DC input on the back. Feels very solid, nice, well built. Got a cooling fan on this side and some intake on this side. On the front, we've got two XT60 connectors and then your balance connectors and then these special pogo pins here that provide the smart technology for this charger. Along with this charger, we get your power cord, a nice assortment of charging cables. You got a couple of XT60s, a couple of EC5s, and a couple of Dean's connectors. You also get this funky USB cable, which is USB B to B. This will probably allow you to connect it to your computer to do firmware updates on it and whatnot. And along with that, we get a manual here. Just has basic information on charging, how to set it up, things like that. All right, let's get this plugged in. Just gonna show you the basic interface here, and then I'm gonna talk to you about this thing's party piece. So starting this up, the fan does stop automatically, which is really nice to see. Now, looking at this interface, I can immediately tell you that this looks very familiar. I've had several Hota chargers in the past, and this looks almost identical to that interface. As a matter of fact, I'm pretty sure that this interface is so familiar that I would bet that Hota is making these chargers for Gen Zace. Let me grab one of my Hota chargers real quick, and I'll show you what I'm talking about. All right, let me just grab my S6 charger here. Oh, that's mounted down. This is the charger I recommend to most people. It's 400 watts and really, really nice, but it's not a smart charger. Now, where is my D6? Let's see, we've got this former race car that I'm gonna be doing some on-road work with. Got some upgrades I'm gonna be doing with my Savage XS here. I've got a drag car I'm gonna be turning into an off-road monster. And here's the charger I wanna show you. Okay, so taking a look at these two interfaces, you can see that they are very, very similar. This main screen doesn't look exactly the same, but if you actually go into a channel, these screens look very similar. And if you go into the menu for the channel, it looks even more similar. So I think Hota is making these chargers or the company that makes Hota chargers is also making these chargers. And that's a very good thing because these are amazing chargers. They're very reliable and they have a great reputation, which means these will almost certainly be really good as well. Taking a closer look at this charger menu, of course we have have two channels on here. This is a 300 watt charger. Each channel allows you to set the charge type, charge, discharge, storage, etc. You can change battery types. This will charge basically any battery out there, just like most modern chargers will. You can change your target voltage, your target current, etc. etc. The real party piece for this comes in with this special little pogo pin right here on the balance connector. That little pogo pin is the G-Tech technology that you see right here for this charger. And that actually interfaces with a pin right here on the special balance plug for these G-Tech batteries. And let me show you what that does when we plug them in to this charger. We'll plug the main cable in and we'll plug the balance cable in. We hear a special tone and we see a charging countdown and we see the cell count and the size and the proper charge current and it automatically begins charging this battery. That is really awesome and it's the party piece of this G-Tech smart charger. What really sets this apart from other smart chargers is what it lets you not do. If you don't wanna use the smart feature of the charger, you don't have to. This charger will easily charge regular old batteries any way you want to using the standard balance connector and the standard output. It also will let you charge your G-Tech smart batteries on any standard charger, meaning I can just take this non-smart charger here and it plugs in just fine. This is in pretty stark contrast to the Spectrum G2 batteries where all the smarts are inside the battery and you cannot externally balance them. The other nice thing about this charger is it has the ability to observe the internal resistances of the batteries, which is incredibly important for monitoring the health of your LiPos. The Traxxas smart charger doesn't have the ability to do that at all and that gives this a great advantage over that charger as well. Now, I didn't just get one of these batteries. I got two of these batteries, and what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna charge them up, and I'm gonna put them in this 
awesome beast of an HPI Savage Flux XL. This is a really cool vintage truck that I recently picked up and I'm excited to throw these batteries in it and check it out. But I've got a new place to bash, so we're gonna see you out there in just a little bit. All right guys, well while I'm charging up these batteries, why don't you go ahead and take a second and get subscribed and hit that bell to get notified of future videos. We have got a ton of really awesome stuff coming up in the future and you are not gonna wanna miss it. I'm gonna finish getting these charged up. I'll see you outside. So do I recommend this Gens Ace iMars D300 smart charger? I think yes. This thing's only 130 bucks and that's a really good deal for what you're getting here. Assuming I'm right about the way the interface is, this thing's made by the same company that makes the Hoda chargers and those are really good, really reliable chargers. Gens Ace is a well-known brand as well. And you're getting a 300 watt on AC charger here that will charge pretty much everything you want at pretty reasonable speeds. That being said though, if you're looking for something that's got even more power than this and you wanna charge those big 6S batteries or really big 4S batteries, check out this charger. 